Sputnik V works well against COVID-19 virus variants, Gamalea claims. Researchers behind the Gamalea's GamCovid vac vaccine or Sputnik V claim that it could effectively counter SARS-CoV-2 variants. They specifically noted that the drug is working very well against coronavirus mutations like the UK and South Africa variants. According to Sky News, Denis Logunov, Deputy Director of the Gamalea Research Institute, revealed the news and emphasized the positive performance of the vaccine in recent trials against new mutations. However, the study containing the numbers is yet to be published. So, there is no information yet on how many people were vaccinated, what calculations were made, and which models or techniques were used to mimic the variants. For those unaware, Sputnik V is a vector-based vaccine that uses modified viruses or vectors to carry a genetic material to induce immune response. In this case, Sputnik V utilizes adenovirus strains to bear a non-infectious part of SARS-CoV-2. This isn't the only vaccine using the technology. The COVID-19 vaccine co-developed by AstraZeneca and the University of Oxford features the same tech. But there are likely differences between the two vaccines. Still, Logunov said, We believe that vector-based vaccines are actually better for future revaccinations than vaccines based on other platforms. On February 20, a published paper on The Lancet showed the efficacy rate of the Sputnik V vaccine. Gamalaya researchers analyzed the data from almost 20,000 trial participants who received either vaccine or placebo shots between September 7 and November 24, 2020. From 21 days after the first dose, 16 of 14,964 participants in the vaccine group and 62 of 4,902 participants in the placebo group were found with COVID-19. Researchers calculated that the efficacy rate was 91.6%. Side effects were reported in both groups. The majority of adverse events were classified as grade 1 or mild, comprising 94% of total events. Around 0.3% in the vaccine group and 0.4% in the placebo group developed serious adverse events which were noted as not associated with vaccination determined by an independent data monitoring committee. Four deaths in the vaccine group and one death in the placebo group were confirmed. All were not considered related to the vaccine. Sputnik V features two adenovirus strains and each carries the instructions for the spike protein of the coronavirus. Russian President Vladimir Putin seems on top of things because he ordered a review of all Russian-produced vaccines for effectiveness against variants by March 15.